the celebration of the Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King Day, but it's also not necessarily a day off, it's a day on for action. Because it's not just a celebration, it is also remembering where we came from and moving forward with a new vigor, with what we like to say we are resetting so that we can release and rise. And this is a very exciting time. I love the energy. I love that the community has come out, a very diverse community, to celebrate civil rights, to celebrate the work that Dr. King did and all the people that worked to make it happen. MLK paved the way for so many. You know, equal rights, let your voice be heard, you know, just to bring in every culture. Um, with what matters and what matters is what we have to bring to society so bringing everybody together no matter where you come from no matter what you look like um, his feet at the statue in, in Washington is not complete because his work is not complete right so it's up to us to finish that that job it's up to each and every last one of us so significant about today is that we don't forget we don't forget prominent leaders in society that we have to continue to walk behind. We have to continue the, the legacy and the message because if you control the message, you, con you control the people, right? And we wanna make sure that we are sending the right message. If we can't do it together, it just can't get done. So that's what's significant about today. It's, it's, it's been a long time coming since COVID. We hadn't been doing this for the past two or three years, I wanna say. Uh, we come out here every single uh, year when the parade presents itself. Uh, it's really important, especially to Cap Alpha Psi, because we understand the trials and tribulations that uh, African Americans went through. Uh, our founding fathers, uh, 10 of them, uh, out of Indiana, 1911, uh, they understood the importance of, one, getting together uh, through trial and tribulation. Uh, we enjoy the parade each year because it brings not only us together, as you can see, uh, a plethora of other people together, knowing it's uh, a day on and not a day off. I mean, he was, I guess you would say, light years ahead of what he was actually trying to showcase. But today it shows that we can live together in harmony, regardless of your race, color, or creed, or gender. And today is a day that we're going to celebrate and honor the man who started it all. I think it's important uh, to come out and uh, celebrate Dr. Martin Luther King because, King Jr., um, because he fought for so many minorities in a place like Hawaii where it's pretty much a melting pot here of different cultures and backgrounds. And that's what, uh, that was Martin Luther King's dream.